Why, hello there! It's me, the interdimensional therapist! The thing that exists that is also a therapist. I don't really understand what emotions really are. What are emotions again? And my practices are that basically I tell my clients to also be like me. An emotionless zombie. So basically that's what I do best. And I also make them I don't know what they think I'm doing wrong. I, I just give them crappy useless puzzles that don't help with anything and as a matter of fact they worsen their mental health. But I don't know what mental health is, so we're in for it. Anyways, I have a nice variety of clients here. And we'll see how they traverse their problems. Here with me is are my notes. Hello. What's your name? My name is Clara. I'm a cow, obviously. Okay. How does that make you feel? Makes me feel really nothing. Hold on a moment, because I don't have opposable thumbs. Or three- I only have three fingers. Stand by, folks. This may take a while. Oh, great. Okay, now that we're all set and ready, what do you feel right now? I feel empty. Ah, okay. We'll put you down on a... Seven. On a scale of one to two to fifty and a half. How, uh, how would you rate your feelings? Zero. There is no zero, but I'll put it there anyways. What do you think about disease? I don't like thinking about it. How do you feel about the concept of time? It's alright. What would you think when if you got found out by a ghost? I'd be kind of happy but sad and kind of scared. Okay, good to know. How what 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 would you feel if you were kidnapped? scared okay well for my notes are all done so I don't need those actually I still need those do, do you mind if I eat my lunch sure not, not at all
2,000 minutes later. Sorry, you all done now? Yes, yes, I am. All of a sudden, my hand fell off as well. I suppose my exoskeleton fell off. Well, let's talk about something else. Your uh, physical stress reminds me of these marbles. So tell me. If you take one marble away from these marbles, which marble is the marble? That's a marble. I don't know. Wrong. It was the one. That was the marble. <laughs> I don't understand you. Nobody does. Well. Would you look at that? A mushroom fell off of my body. What the heck? I grow spores. Do you want it? No. I don't want to be here anymore. Okay, see you next week or something like that. I don't know how this works. Hello, Mr. Frog. I believe that's your name. How are you feeling today? Meh. Oh, that's very sad. Uh, uh, how does that make you feel? Meh. And how does that make you feel? Meh. Does that make you feel anything other than that? Okay, then. Oh, hello, Pisquin. Pisquin, is that your name, Pisquin? Yes, that is my name. Why am I even here? Yeah, I have reason to believe that you have multiple identities. In what way do I have multiple identities? You do somehow, but I don't. No. How? No. On a scale of 1 to 10, how would you rate your squish meter? What in the god dang Kreblu are you talking about? What even is a squish meter? Let me to demonstrate. <laughs> This is my squish sack. How does that... How is your squish meter? I don't know. I don't want to be here anymore. Okay, see you next week then, I guess. Or something. creepy dude who keeps on following me. I don't know who he is. Or something. Well, that's very sad. What, what makes you feel that way? I don't know. I'm just scared. Well, allow me to, allow me to introduce something. My mind is only books and pages, ones that I have stolen from other things.
What even is this? It's Storig. Storig. Don't you know the Storig? Is this some sort of war? No, it's called the Death. Spell D E T H of seventy of twenty of twenty seven. Where did you get this from? I don't know. Some weird giant, uh, some weird fox goblin thing. That's the thing that's been chasing me. He doesn't know you're here, does he? No. Does he know I'm here? I don't know. Probably not. Uh, you want to see some more of my mind pages? Sure. Okay. Um, math book. What? Why are we doing this again? Because it helps your mindset. That's why. What is your feeling on interdimensional shapes? The heck is an interdimensional shape? Like, what is that even? I'm sorry, that one helps me talk. I need to put that back in my mind hole. Oh, my fingers. Can I leave now? No. I don't want to look at that. What? Are you just... Are, am I... Are you pretending I'm not even here? No. No, you are definitely here. You're not acting like it. I'm totally acting like it. What are you even talking about? No, I mean seriously, what are you talking about? What? Why are you just pulling random things out of your head? Where are you even getting these things from your head? Well, time to look through some sketchbooks, or whatever these are. You're not acting like I'm here. I feel like this is useless. No! We must see! Nobody can see this. Good! <laughs> no! I- I'm not comfortable being here. Good! I'm leaving. Ah, no! No, no, fuck! I- uh, I don't remember where I am. Hello, sir. You must be my final client. So, what what does that make you feel like? <laughs> wow, that's a great story. How does that make you feel? <laughs> Okay. It's like these beads. I, I mean marbles. You eat them, and then they give you infinite knowledge. Oh! <laughs> Go ahead. Set them anywhere. Now eat them in front of me. <laughs> mm -hmm. 
There you go, buddy. How does that make you feel? I think I've had a pretty productive day. Well, I best be going home then.